What's up everybody? Bill with Honest Open Permaculture Hot Farm. We're back with the Set It and Forget It compost pile. It's been about one month, a little over a month since we touched it. And let me walk you around give you a sh and show you what it's looking like. So I haven't even had a cover on it for probably the past 20, 25 days at least. So I've let the ducks go at it, the chickens go at it. Mother Nature beat it up. It's spread apart more than I'd like it to be. So we're gonna, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go around with a little mower and pick up all the stuff on the outside, help chop it even finer, and then flip it to that spot right there. So here it is, here's the outside of it, still looks like leaves. We get a little bit closer. It's wet in the middle. Like it just pulled off that first little spot and we got earthworms all through it, so that's good. So let's give this thing a turn. It's been sitting, like I said, over a month, and I'm sure it needs some air. Don't want to mow over the water hose. There's another reason I'm mowing this. I'll let you know in just a second. So by me mowing this, it's also adding some grass clippings to the pile. Some green grass clippings, which is a source of nitrogen, which will help heat this pile back up and get it cranking again. That's a good base. And we cleaned up around that compost pile. Alright guys, so I'm adding those green grass clippings as a source of nitrogen to this pile. I bet most of the, sort, the original source of nitrogen we added to it with the duck poo and the duck bedding has been used up. So we're going to add some more with these green grass clippings. We're adding water because that's one of the four ingredients that you have to have for a compost pile. So we got nitrogen, water, carbon, and oxygen. Carbon is the leaves, the cardboard that's in here. And the oxygen is getting added as we're turning it. So once we're done turning this whole compost pile, it'll have all the ingredients it needs to heat up as a hot compost and really take off and make some good stuff. All right, so we turned it, we added the oxygen to it, and we also added some more nitrogen with the grass clippings. So that's all we're gonna do to it for at least a month. We'll let it sit there. Uh, we might actually use it in a couple of weeks, depending on what it looks like. And a garden we just started revamping over here that Aaron's over there working on. 
she's loosening up some soil it's really hard red clay up there she's gonna loosen up some soil and we'll probably use this pile in that area let's walk you around the pile show you what it looks like it's looking good for being three months old and only been messed with twice we put it together and then we messed with it twice so it looks good thank you all for watching if you're interested to see how we originally put this pile together there's a video popping in right there click on that it'll show you how we put it together also if you're not subscribed please hit that subscribe button there you go